Velour Institute of Technology VIT University is one of the premier institutes in India which offers various opportunities to its students to not only excel in academics but also encourages them to implement their engineering skills in projects and participate in various national and international engineering competitions we are the members of students for exploration and development of space which is an international space aid organization when we heard about the european rover challenge we being space enthusiasts thought that this is the best platform for us to not only showcase our passion for space by making a mars rover but also test our engineering skills we named our team vyad which in sanskrit means serious which is the brightest star in the night sky rover has been divided into several subsystems rocker boggy mechanism has been employed to ensure that the rover transverses over any kind of uneven and rough terrain to ensure integrated motion of the rocker and boggy a bevel gear assembly of three straight teeth bevel gear has been used Fourth gear has been attached to the assembly to rule out the possibility of gear slip. It is one of the safety systems incorporated in the rover. The new design of the wheel houses the drive motor inside the wheel, which prevents the motor housing from interfering with the motion of the rocker and boggy. The chassis has been manufactured using aluminium 6061 T6. Our team is currently working on finishing up of the robotic arm, where the two electric linear actuators and a servo motor at the base will give the robotic arm a total of 6 degrees of freedom. The links of the robotic arm will be manufactured using carbon fiber tubes. Mechanical team consists of six members. Ashish and Sohini are responsible for designing of the rover. Fazal and Nilesh are responsible for its testing and analysis, whereas Madhuvir and I are responsible for the fabrication of the rover. The electrical subsystem consists of various components to ensure easy maneuvering of the rover. To power up our rover, we have used 11.8 volt, 8 ampere LiPo batteries in a stack of three. To supply such large amount of current, we have used wires. AWG gauge rating of 12 the moment of a rover is achieved with the help of six motors and the command for the moment is sent over 433 megahertz rf module we are using three cameras for our rover the primary is mounted behind the robotic arm for overview of the terrain the secondary and tertiary cameras are mounted on robotic arm and at the front of the rover for photographic documentation and visual automatic respectively all visual data will be sent over gcs using 2.4 gigahertz wifi module The rover is controlled and monitored using a laptop. For this purpose, we have developed a sophisticated software package using Python and its various libraries. This is the GUI of our software. The GUI, uh, as you can see, that the uh, the GUI can be controlled using a keyboard or a uh, game controller. This choice has been provided to give a very effective control over the rover. And also, the GUI contains provision to very systematically uh, and in a very neat manner display the various. Uh, various telemetry data and the various video feed that we capture other than this we have also provided a blind navigation feature which will help the operator to navigate the rover without use of any kind of visual data the given window will take the input of the various coordinate to be visited by the rover and uh, using this data a virtual simulation will be created the virtual simulation will show the coordinates to be visited by the rover and the position of the rover the cs team consists of three members I was tasked with designing the UI and its various algorithms. Costa was tasked to handle the various communication between the ground control station and the onboard microcontrollers. Shivam was uh, tasked with programming the onboard microcontrollers and the visual automatic. The SGID management team consists of five members who are assigned different tasks. The management team is held responsible for conducting regular intervals of meetings. and sponsorship and handling the social media team rakhyan prashanti were responsible for the social media team lagu and bharadwaj were responsible for the sponsorship team whereas kunal was handling the design i myself was overseeing the management